Welcome back. We're not gonna mess around. We're gonna get naked as fast as possible. We got everything that we need here, okay? We got some alcohol. We got some electric tape. We got a 1.5 millimeter screwdriver, hex driver, whatever thing. We got a little tongue brush. I've seen people use toothbrushes, but I like the tongue brush more. You scrape the crap off your tongue. You scrape, yeah, it just works well. And then we got a couple little Q-tips. Oh, and a roll of paper towel. So I got this roll of paper towel here. Let's get the party started. I know what you're here for, so I'm gonna give it to you as fast as possible, okay? So first we're gonna unscrew the uh, camera, get it out of our way. There we go. Screw is off. And you're gonna pull out this little thing. There we go, so that thing's off. And pop the camera off. So I didn't pull it off, I popped it off, just so you know, you gotta pop it off. Okay, now let's unscrew this, and let's see what kind of wonders await us. Yes. So exciting, it's gonna be the most exciting, naked, unboxing nakedness, or whatever, I don't even know what I'm saying. But we're gonna do it. What are you waiting for? Do it! We're Just gonna do it. Do okay. it! Yes, you can! Just do it! On my channel, I like to focus on uh, sub 250 builds, so, and I work with analog and digital. And for basically all your digital builds, you, you, if you're going sub 250, you want to make these naked. I did break my last one, but I, I also am a little bit of an idiot with them, so I hope my, um, because I, I ended up buying the Nebula V2 because it's the only one I could find. So I'm hoping that my Nebula Pro camera will work with this, but I'm basically taking this apart and uh, I'm going to see if I can do that. So now we're going to pop these things off. Carefully, carefully. Okay, so we got one off. We got the other one off. And with these, you never pull them. You never, like, pull it off. You gotta pop it off. My nails are long and disgusting now, so that actually helps me. I was gonna cut my nails for you so that no one pick on me. But if you want to pick on me, go for it. Oh my goodness, your nails are so ugly. Thanks, okay. It's all good, it's all good. So we got our paper towel ready because things are about to get nasty. Are you ready for it? Okay, let's, once again, my long nails are being put to good use. Avery, nice and quiet, please. Okay. There we go, we got this gucky blue stuff. We don't even need to worry about that one. We'll just take that right, at, well, let's do one side at a time. First, we're gonna use some paper towel and try rubbing it off. Very nice, we got a decent amount off. We're doing a little bit of pre-cleaning before the deep, before the deep clean. Okay, very nice. It's a lot of food. This is alcohol. So now I'm gonna go and give it an extra little bit of a scrub scrub. And more wipage. And more scrubbage. I'll turn it sideways. Oh, very nice. And this thing is built very well. Like, it's built amazing. So, you don't have to be super delicate or worry that much. I am a delicate person, but... We're trying to, to make this nice and easy. I've seen some of the other videos and they, they seem to take their time. And I just want to do this nice and quick for you. Give you a nice quick video, show you how it's done, and show you that it's, it's pretty easy. You just gotta grow your nails for a bit. <laughs> I'll just take that one and get it out of there. We don't need that. And we're gonna just, once again, just wipe the excess off as much as we can. And then... Will we wipe those ones? Uh, those ones we don't even need to worry about. We can just leave those, hide them somewhere. Put them in some plastic bag or something. 
Yeah, yeah. Okay. We should wipe them. We should wipe them? Okay, maybe we will. Oh, I got some inside the little in there. That's not good, but it will be okay. Everything's going to be fine. That's what I always tell myself, you know, no matter what, things are going down or whatever, you just, everything's going to be fine. Avery, use the mouse to skip the commercial. You know how to skip the commercial. Yeah, I know. Good. Come on, you know how to skip the commercial. Good. You did it. Good job. Now I'm going to just get in there and try and uh, clean this mess. I shouldn't have done that. I shouldn't have let any go in there. That was not good. That was very bad of me. You forgive me? Even though I was bad? Yeah. Okay. Very good. Okay. That's that's pretty nice. Let's see that one now. Okay. Ooh, that even looks better than that side. Okay, you know, let's clean this too. Let's get it. Make an effort to let that gold stand out, you know? If you're enjoying this video, please click the like button. It costs you nothing. It means the world to me. Okay, so we got one side done. Where's the other one? Oh, here it is. It's right in front of me. I'm just getting anxiety because I'm trying to do this as fast as possible for the good people that are watching because I know people have no bloody attention span these days. What the heck is that? Who knows? Oh, it's probably some of the rubber. So all these pieces I'm just putting off to the side. Okay. Well, this piece of uh, paper towel went pretty far. Here, take it, throw it in the garbage. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. May you live a long life and be very fertile and bring me lots of grandchildren. Right? <laughs> of course. <laughs> Back in the day, like, having kids was a blessing, so I always like to bless people with the blessing of fertility. May you be fertile and have many children. <laughs> May all you viewers be very fertile and have many children. Be blessed. Oh yeah. Oh, we got the epic music. It is encouraging me to like do an epic job. Very good. Scrub a dub dub. Oh, very. You know what? That looks pretty good to me. What do you guys think? You think that looks nice? Do you like that? Is that good? Is that you like it? Yes, you do. Okay. And if you do like it, just a reminder. Huh? They didn't put any blue stuff on this side. What the heck? What the heck's up with that? <laughs> That's quality control. What the heck? But you know what? It makes it easier for us. There we go. We did it in less than 10 minutes. So now these things, you have to be, oh, yes, the next step. You know what? Let's do the Q-tip. Let's clean it up with a little bit of Q-tip and get it extra nice and clean. Woo! Well, is it making that much of a difference? No. Oh, Avery. It's making a huge difference. You don't know what you're talking about. You're only three years old. I'm not. Yeah, you are. I'm not. Yeah, you are. I'm not. You're going to be four soon, though. I'm okay, you know what? The Q-tip's just a waste of time. Don't even bother with the Q-tips. There you go. You just learned something. One step down. You are three years old. Okay, now you see there's going to be one on this side and one on this side, right? So, yeah. do we do it like this? No. you got to look at it, line it up, and put it back like that. But what we're going to do is there's these little metal pieces... And you're going to pull this little metal piece right off and stick it to the side with all the other stuff you don't need. And then you take the metal stuff on here, on this side, you're going to take that off also. This is a very important step, okay? Okay, now you're going to take your little scissors and your little tape. 
And what you're going to do is you're going to cut one. Okay. And two. Save that. Maybe we might need more. And you're going to take your um, electric tape and you're going to put it where that other tape was. So you see that? Very nice, very beautiful. Do it on the other side too. Let's like really try and line it up nicely. Yeah. Because you don't want these metal things to be touching other things or else you're going to destroy your whole stuff. So, very good. And let's do the other side. That's good. That's good? I did a good job? Mm -hmm. I'm glad you think I did a good job on this at least. You have to look at the thing, make sure you line it up. So this gets lined up with this one. Oh, very nice. And then this gets lined up with this one. Does that protect the drone? There we go. So now it's in. You see the electric tape stops the uh, the thing from touching the other thing. And same thing here. The electric tape stops from those two sides touching. So you got that electric tape and then you can, you have your camera and you can just stick your camera right back in. Push it in there. Very nice. And there you go. You got a naked Cadex Vista or whatever, yeah. So it's naked, it's good to go, you're good to uh, wire it up and do all that stuff. And now you're gonna fly, it's gonna be a lot lighter and you're gonna have a great time. So if that helped you, please like the video and consider subscribing. Our channel's all about sub 250 builds and sub 250 fun. And ho hope you love FPV, I'm loving it and I'm doing it mostly by myself and you know, if you join, subscribe, and hang out, and talk in the comments and stuff, then I won't have to feel so alone on this beautiful journey. Okay. Uh, check out the next video if you'd like. Watch all the videos if you want. And happy flying.